All right, guys. So today we're gonna be doing a um car build. Any random car? I'm not sure exactly what car I wanna use. Um, thinking about the 240, but I already have a drift 240, so I don't. Not really sure right now. <coughs> not sure what time this video will upload because I'm gonna um. Probably I'm recording at 11:16 p.m. So I'm probably gonna be up in the morning or whatever. I don't know. I'll see what happens. We're definitely not building up the American. Yeah, I don't think so. I think I'm gonna build a 370Z. What the hell? Let's look at the minis. Wait, no. Keep going. How does the Volkswagen look? Like, how is that looking? These have some type of good engine swap. I forgot what engine it is, but it's runs pretty good. Surprised I ain't doing it those yet. Car sits nice. The old STI, I think it is. Two wheel. I'm gonna build one of these. I'm gonna go to simple build. Don't ask why I have 81 grand. Don't worry about that. I'm broke. <laughs> I have any glitch just for builds. I don't wanna do builds. Uh, 360, I used to have a little, I had the glitch that way I got like a billion dollars. So I could basically do whatever I wanna do. Hold on, let me reply to this message. Try drive one hand clutch. Oh wait, I know what I gotta do. We am bugging. Totally. Yeah, I really am bugging. It's a control. Uh, that should be better. Let me check one more thing. I really like how these engines sound. Imagine drifting this car stock. I feel like it wouldn't be that bad. Especially this miserable. Like I would actually drive one daily one. And to slowly build it. <coughs> so yeah. Um, typical me would go with the um, RB26 engine in it. But V8. Like, wouldn't that be nice just to have the title V8? Too weird. Like, that'd be actually dope. Like, Forza Horizon. Nah, I'm doing that. Like, I don't care. Forza Horizon V8. Like, what I'm doing. Oh, and they got a twin turbo kit and a supercharger. Uh, let that hold off. You'll see how much power we go for. Because I haven't done a, a <clears throat> non turbo build in so long yet. It's crazy. I forgot non turbo exists. Like, it's crazy. I'm gonna go for a little sleeper look, kinda. Just chill look. Nothing big. 
nothing crazy done to it, you know. Like that's a no no. That's not. They have some crazy body kits for these cars, yeah. Like some of them are ugly, and some of them look good. But I want to go ahead and I'm not gonna just buy upgrade guys. Kind of a lot of people hate that. And I do too. But you can make 928. I guess this is non turbo, and this is with turbo. But that's all that. I'm not doing all that. I'll do this one. If you want to see how much horsepower the V8 makes? If you want to do that, you just go over here. And you see where it said displacement? That's how you know. The higher displacement, which means it will be the V8 when it low displaces it, like. Uh, like that to the stock engine. Uh, they don't even got some old RB in here. But yeah, I think they don't. I think I'm bugging. Yeah, th that's the RB engine, and I think. Uh, yeah, I think I'm bugging. I don't even know. But I feel like the settings are off still. Hold on, let me mess with these color settings for y'all real quick. Hopefully, I'm not making them worse. But anyway, I think that's a little better. A little less color, but it looks a little better to me. So. We're gonna leave the V8 in here, and I'm just gonna. Typical me would go with something big first, like cams and a block. Well, I'm gonna run out of money soon, so whenever that happens, then I'll probably just start using tokens. I hate using tokens because it takes so much longer to upgrade your car, to me, in my opinion. 605 horsepower. So far, um, I think it's gonna be a successful build. Uh, I'll leave stock exhaust. I'll do the valve stands. Fuck you. Alright, and then we're gonna do the flywheel. There's flywheels for more like torquey and if you make them too much power for your clutch, you're gonna need a good flywheel. A very good flywheel. Bug, I just clicked that. I wasn't even paying attention. Uh, as long as it doesn't take out the other seat, I don't really, Nah. Let's leave full weight. I mean, it is a sleeper. Let's drop these on it. Of course, those sleepers have to drive good too. So when you creep up on someone, you know you can beat them. You won't just be sliding around or anything. Uh, I'm gonna put springs on it, coilovers. I have a problem. With whatever, whenever I put coilovers on the car, I always drop it too low. Mm, look like more options. Anyway, I always drop it too low. But anyway, so today, yeah, that's gonna be too low. Today when I hopped on to get on Forza, I meant to do a video from a while ago. Oh, what the hell? I wanted to do a video from my, like a while ago, but then I realized that Forza, like it had to be synced and whatever, and it was taking forever to sync. So that's what happened with this video. I was supposed to make it from a, like a long, lot earlier. Forza was not trying to let me sync it. So I'm like, what happened was right. I had to sit there and let it load, and then it went to, it finished loading, and then it wouldn't start the game. So I went on the Forza forum thing. I was like. I was looking, looking on there like I wonder if anyone got anyone else had the same problem. I mean, I hope my data don't like my data don't got get messed up. So I looked up there, nothing. Yeah, I just started restarted the Xbox, and then when I went to go do the thing over, surprisingly, it just said go to nine. It it started back where I left off at, which was ninety nine percent. So I was alright with that. It just took a little while, and then since I was already laying down waiting on it, it was like uh, I don't really feel like moving right now. So that's what happened. I was just sitting in my bed, trying to get up, you know, like an old person. No offense to old people. Just take long to get up sometimes, you know. It's all good. Uh, hmm. <coughs> Alright, what type of tires and rims are we going to run? Are we going to change rims? 
Cause I'll do some simple rims. So like they, they can't be too cr like that. It would just look like I was trying to be a cop or something. Like it have to be some simple rims. Like even something like that. But I'm not doing that. That's no no. That's not gonna happen. Nope nope nope. Like I would even do those, but no. The quality of the sound, like the quality, should sound a little bit better now because before I used to have my playback on, which means like stereo to play out through the through the TV. But now since I bought the turtle beaches, they don't play out through the TV. So whatever volume you're hearing is coming straight from the capture card, which is, should be good. I almost feel like putting some simple rooms like this on. Like I would put Ray Volks if they weren't as pop that popular. But everyone like as soon as I take it out the garage like online or anything, people can be like, oh look at Ray Volks, look at Ray Volks, yeah, that car's fast, yeah. Look what it ha look what it has on it, like you know? So no. Uh I think these might go. Yeah, I'll I'll put those on. Shut the fuck up. Alright guys, so we got running those, and we're gonna put good tires on it, like, cause like what I say, just cause it's a sleeper down, I mean, it ha oh, 275 is pretty wide, if you think about it, I mean, it's not like it's wide body, so it shouldn't have the wide tires like that, front, I'll leave, I'll actually widen it, cause, I hate to see cars come with stock, like, certain width on tires, and then people get buy rims, and they get the same width, that came with the tire, like, at least upgrade the tire width so you know you get better traction and stuff. It's like, um, <clears throat> I don't know, I feel like whatever width comes out of your tire, you should upgrade it because that's probably not the best for you. So that's how I feel, but I doubt it. But that's how I feel about it. I almost feel like running 20s in the back, but I hate how you can't do the tire size, so nah, I'll leave it like that. The front bumper is like iffy, this bumper. But no, nah, I'm not gonna do it. it. Like makes me wanna do it so bad, but I'm not gonna do it. And shout out to Forza from last video I did about the EK. They um marked as copyrighted because I guess the music like playing on the radio in this game. How you cop wait nah I can say how you um how you copyrighted for uh doing a gaming video, right? And that's the like that's the music that was playing in the game, like that's like playing GTA and a theme song playing. Good copyrighted. Like what? I mean, t I just don't understand that. Other people probably do, but I just don't. It's retarded. Oh, fuck. I'll do this one. What do you... No, that's not even good. I think I usually do six. But some cars it looks like a small six. Hey, how you can never get the license plate like the size? Well, for me, I can never get the license plate that size looks good to me. Like, it always looks too big or something. And then when I try to put the license plate cover on it, like, this is going to be too big or too small. See? But fuck. I'll put that. I'll leave that bitch right there. Fuck out of here. That's good. That's good. I'll probably paint it, though. Hopefully the game volume sounds good, cause I've been having a lot of trouble lately getting it right. Like it's either the what am I drawing? Either that's like one is always too high. Either the game volume is too high or the um like the commentary is too high. That looks pretty mean, but I don't want something like look that would go perfectly together, like the rim color. But I, like I said, I want something that looks too stand. It stands out too much. I want something that kind of blends in. That's not gonna happen with these colors, though. Hold on, I'm just in my head. So, so yeah, like I was saying, I want something that look more blends in. Like it doesn't look too crazy. It doesn't just jump out. But I feel like I'm gonna end up going with like. Can I customize these? Oh wow, I can't customize colors. Get childish. All 
Sorry, you leave it that color didn't help. Oh, that looks mean. I don't even want it fully black. Like, what if I could do like a red or blue, like a dark, dark blue? Alright, I'm gonna settle for that. Kinda not too slippery, but they're not too not like it doesn't look pop out crazy like it's gonna be a V8 in there. You seen this put up, you be like, oh look, he just bought this, he just financed it, he just put some rims on it. There you go, boom. Or he even probably leased it. Well actually if you lease it, I don't think you could touch that at all, period. So uh, is that it? Oh I forgot that. I don't know if I remember to check the word fire. Oh wait, it only makes six fifty. Yes, yeah, let me see it's fifty. All right, that's not gonna happen with me. So I guess we're gonna go back and add either the supercharger or the turbo. Kind of want to do supercharger only because not a lot of people do it, and you know, it's like why not that supercharger? Not a lot of people do it, and yeah, I don't have nothing against supercharger. I just don't use it a lot, so I might as well use it for once. It only makes eight thirteen. Which can't be that. It's not that bad. Supercharger aren't too bad. You make less horsepower on turbos. But if you tune right, you could beat a turbo easy. Because I know someone who always builds a car. Like, almost the same car as me. He would listen to my engine and swap the engine out. The exact For the exact engine I have and still not beat me. So. Yeah, so I mean, it's all about tuning too. But I'm not going to tune this car only because, I don't know. Gonna try to find this. So, where does the boost come in? The turbo wine is. Oh, it isn't already. This is just a lot you really hear. I was like, hey, but am I gonna hear boost? Like what type? Like um, yeah, supercharger one. It was a little too loose, but then tight at the same time. I was gonna hit you if I didn't do that. I'm sorry. I think I'm gonna have to do a GTA build next, guys. I'm tired of seeing you. I'm about to just race you and get it over. Move on my way. Come on. Oh, 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 now I should race you when you stuck just to be a cheater. I'll probably lose anyway without trash control. I'm always losing races, but upgraded cars without trash control. So I'm going to tell y'all a little tip to tuning. I was given the tip, used the tip, and it was pretty good. So, all right. With tuning, you want your cars to, you want your gears to be tuned funny. I'm going to tell you, it's in the gears. They have to be tuned funny. Everything with the car has to be tuned funny. But you have to tune it for certain stuff. Like, my cars are mostly tuned for, like, roll. Say 60 roll, you tune it at that. So you have good acceleration, but not in, not too much acceleration, not too much power. Because if you have too much acceleration and too much power at the same time, you're just going to spin your tires. So you kind of have to pick which, in, like, with, you know how, uh, can I pause? Yeah, I can't, duh, I'm not Um, so it's, for example, this is not tuned, so I'll show you all this. Um, speed, you have to choose right in the middle between speed and acceleration. Don't just put it in the middle, but like, say this, say if I put it all the way down, you just gotta mess with it and find out whenever, um, did I ever stiffen this car up? And find out basically, like, where's the weak spot for the car. Say if you move off at 60, this is gonna spin tires. You just gotta figure it all out. So that's basically all you gotta do. If you, if you can figure it all out, then you're good. You can figure it all out, then you're pretty good. I kind of figured it out. My first car tune was the Corolla that I, sh that I have in my garage. Oh god, what was I looking at? I'm but yeah, the first. Am I on? Oh yeah, yeah. That's why my car feel like that. But yeah. 
So the first car I did it on was a Corolla. So yeah, this car feels funny. I don't think I should have messed with the um entire overall shit or whatever it's called. But yeah, I'm thinking about racing this dude right here. 20 minutes into the video, I hate doing long videos. So next video I'll be doing will probably be a GTA video again. That little Mustang video, I deleted it. So yeah, if you didn't see it, sorry. I might do another one today. I don't know. Oh what? What? This is some cheating. How they gonna do that? And then watch, he gonna take a nice cut across the road. Watch. It's some cheaters, I swear. They know this LS don't got traction, whatever this fellow is. I don't focus LS. Fuck LS. Like two days on RBs. Black nigga shit. Let me stop. Anyway. I would honestly like if he can't. Alright, he. Oh no, I think he's stuck somewhere. I was gonna say, he's probably just gonna cheat and cut across it. Oh god, I'm about to cut across it too because. This car handles like shit. Anyway, it's, I mean, it's a good sleeper. Like, if you put up on someone with this on the highway, they're just gonna be like, what the hell is that? And they probably would be not even wanna race you. Like, like, if they heard about you racing another car, they'd be like, oh, he spanked that 2J. And they, they'd look at the car, they're gonna be like, what? And they're gonna wanna race you, I'm telling you, they don't wanna race you. And then you bring them out on a nice straight road and you bust them. Like, say this road right here. You do a nice pull. Of course, you tune your car, right? That we won't get them wheel spin. I'm not gonna tube this car because it's not gonna be my main priority, I guess you could say. Fuck this too, I'll cut across this too. Oh god, what just happened? Bottom out a little bit. But yeah. So that's I gave y'all a tip about tuning. That's all you gotta really do. Just got you just make sure your gears are like balanced out kinda, I guess you could say. So yeah. I got this race that's like forty nine grand. Something like that. That was, that was, yeah, that was stupid because he's like not even that far. Yeah, he really isn't that far. Alright, he's right behind me. So, yeah, just do that. Like, make sure your tuning is balanced right in the middle or whatever. I feel like I got less money before. Anyway. So, I'm just gonna give y'all a little look around this car. Nice New York plate on it. Hella flush license plate cut on uh, whatever it's just called. Play, uh, frame that's yes, yeah, frame let's play frame some decent normal looking rims, I guess you could say. Not stock, I, not normalizing stock looking, but like just simple looking. The height is not too bad, but I have good suspension on it. I stiffened them up a little bit. Let's go for top end, stop speed room. Remember, this is it, could be a lot faster too. If I had a twin turbo with it instead of uh, supercharging it. So if you want to go a little faster, just supercharge. Um, twin turbo years. Okay, so the tops are around two something, but that's for no tune. So now if you go and tune your gearbox to final drive, and whatever, the final drive, then you get more top end. I'm sure you would, because I don't think they'd make this car and do 204. So you get more top end. And then if you want, you could tune it so it gets more acceleration than top end. So, yeah. It's whatever you want, I guess. I think I'm going to do a GTA video. I don't know if I want to use Elgato or use the Rockstar uh, thing. I think I'm going to use the Rockstar, though. I mean, the Elgato. Because Rockstar, like, I don't know. I suck editing with it. I don't edit with nothing, really. I don't edit these videos anyway. But just Rockstar just... To me, it's more difficult. It's difficult than this. Like, a lot more difficult. Whatever that is. Yeah. You know what I mean. It's harder to use. To so, yeah. So, yeah. Just make sure you will final drive tuning or whatever. And I'm, I'm like trying to focus and talk and drift through here without messing with all these points. Surprised I didn't mess it up already. But yeah, so tune your gears like right between. You, you want like, good acceleration and good speed at the same time. So guys, I was playing Black Ops the other day, right? And I was like, yo, I really do suck. Like, 
I was actually doing decent online for a little while, and then like once you stop playing for a little bit, yeah, and you stop, you start like playing just one game for a little while, like GTA, it's over. Like you suck in the other game. You have to get back into your mood, yeah. That's some real shit. But yeah, so when I start getting back into my mood for Black Ops, I'll, I'm sure I'll start doing better. Right now, I'm just kind of annoyed with it. So yeah, I'm doing a little drifting. I suck, I know. It's all good. I just did a good, um, like J, whatever you call it, J turn, whatever. I was like, hey, let me try to continue it. Kind of, I like red line this thing. Red line this thing. I can see why um people like putting LS in them. Put like put put like putting the LS in different cars. They just pretty good to red line, especially like drifting. There was a. I don't know if y'all, any of y'all watch Adam LZ. Those he had, he was driving a, I think it was, was it LS? Yeah, I think it was LS or V8, whatever. It was, I'm not sure if it's a regular V8, but I think it was LS. It was a, uh, I think it was a, it was S14 or 15 Sylvia. Yeah, it had an LS and it. it was basically, it was pretty good for drifting. First. Alright guys, I'm in this video right here because it's at 26 minutes and no one's gonna watch it because like longer than this.